Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Three Kingdoms with Zhang Yan on Legendary Difficulty. Where last time left off, we had acquired peace with Kong Rong. That was one war we managed to uh, stay away from, or deal with at least. Uh, we also uh, dealt with this army, which had, didn't have uh, Dong Zhou in it before, but it does now. Um, so that's interesting. Hopefully they won't come our way. I don't think he will because this army is very dead until it's taking attrition. This guy might come back, but we have recruited a full stack in here now. It's just going to take some time to replenish, but that's okay. Uh, Lu Bu, on the other hand, went away. So I'm kind of wondering what he's up to. He might go towards my trade port or something, which would suck. But it does have a fairly solid garrison in there too. Could recruit a couple generals and hopefully I'd be okay. But against Lu Bu, I probably wouldn't be. But oh, he's 58 years old already. To be fair, I mean, he's an adoptive father. 70 fucking 5 though. <laughs> Okay, that's okay, all right. Um, and then here we were gonna recruit the full stack, but we couldn't quite get it done. We got Sao P in here though. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's what what we're uh, dealing with right now. Uh, and then we attacked this place here, but unfortunately I couldn't quite reach this army, which kind of sucks. I'm also kind of surprised that we didn't even get an ambush in on that in the first place, which kind of uh, is unfortunate as well. Uh, oh, I'm going to ambush stance. I mean, the chance, I think, is... Well, it's still 75% chance. Here, go on then. Why not? Maybe it works. Who knows? Uh, but yeah, we didn't get an ambush on this army at all when we attacked it. And then it ran away. And then we besieged the town. We couldn't, unfortunately, reach that army anymore, which kind of puts a damper in it. I don't want to attack the actual town. Although we have four trebuchets, it's not even that bad. And this reinforcement army wouldn't be a problem because we should be able to kill them off before they even arrive. So it might not even be the worst idea. To do it right now but it's 100 percent strength we have four trebuchets but two of those don't have um explosive oh no we do actually have explosive shell on them as well now but even then there's no holes in the wall now nah, i'm gonna take that i'm gonna take the chance i will start building shit though just in case uh the man surrender is not gonna do anything because they this is their final town so they're not gonna give it to me yeah, this army could be annoying. It could run that way if I wanted to, but if it does, then we can just take this next turn without any issue. So I'm assuming it's going to come back. And other than that, I think we are at the end of this turn here. Uh, oh yeah, and we've got we also have been we've gone to war with uh, Zheng Zhang, who I don't even know where her town is, um, but she must have one because otherwise, how is she able to sustain that army? I can't see anything around here. So unless she's taking something all the way over here. Like, how is that even possible? Also, we've been friends with her for so long. I'm just kind of sad that she declared war on me. She got, she got pulled into the war, but even so. Also, I can see now... You are strength rank 2, you are strength rank 1. Okay, so I'm actually still... I'm third, I guess, and I'm still lower than both of them. Which kind of sucks, but... We're also almost out of food. Don't exactly know why. We gave 10 away to Kong Rong, I suppose, but even then... Uh, this army is now over here. We are we're gonna have three armies over here, but that's technically okay because it, this technically we're supposed to be going on defensive against Liu Bei. Because honestly, we just gotta take out a couple of Liu Bei armies, um, make him abdicate, and we finish the campaign. So we're really close to finishing the campaign. Honestly, it's just you know we gotta deal with all this other shit all the time. Um, we also we have someone available apparently. We can afford Wang. Yeah, he's the guy I'm gonna recruit though. Uh, we have. Let's see. How many towns do we have? That's actually what I do want to know. Currently, we have 61. Because we do need 95. Besides becoming emperor. Having all seats under our control. So we do need 34 more regions. And I doubt that Liu Bei has that many. Eh, although, actually. Well, this isn't all his. Well, there's a bunch of stuff that's his. Uh, all of these ones over here, that's like four or five, six, I guess we can read, we can check them all. Uh, there's one more, okay, so five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Obviously, he's got a couple over here. Uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And he might lose that one too, because he's getting, getting attacked over here. But either way, even if I got all of those, it still wouldn't be enough. So I'd have to take more stuff. So I guess having Zhang Yan over here spending his retirement, uh, a time in retirement, taking these uh, Han Empire towns might not be a bad idea. Uh, okay. Also, 
They could very easily put an army on the, a boat here, sail around and take my town here. That would kind of suck. But oh well. Um, and yeah, there's there's more stuff I could take on the way as well with these armies. So I get, I, I'm sure we'll be okay. But uh, also, I don't think I counted that one, did I? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure I counted several of these I didn't count. Well, whatever, it doesn't really matter. There's also one over here I didn't count. There's, we're going to be close, but maybe not all the way there. Anyway, I think we're at the end of the turn, so let's go ahead and end this turn. I really don't want him to declare war on me right now. Mostly because he has two armies in my territory right now, and I don't know what the fuck he's planning on doing with those. Oh, is he still coming over to defend me? Oh, they just switched general. You are going to my port, unfortunately, which kind of sucks. There's not a whole lot I can do about that. In fact, I don't have any generals available. I'd have to recruit someone from outside the faction. You're going towards my city, and I'm being... Oh, okay, he's actually going for the town here. Wow, okay, I didn't expect that. All right, well, uh, this is a town where we have six units of cav, which is going to make me do a lot of damage. Possibly not enough, but if that means we can deal with this really easily, so we can take that and then come over here and take this from him. So I think we'll be okay. Even if we lose this, we'll be okay. This is a wall settlement, I'm assuming, as a toolmaker. So we're going to hope that our walls do enough damage here. Or, our, sorry, not walls, uh, our towers do enough damage. I guess, what do you call this? Because you've got encampments, which is the stance, encampment stance. You've got towns, like walled settlements, and then you've got like resource building or resource uh, provinces, I guess, but it's kind of difficult to find a name for them. Did they have no cav? Yeah, they have one cav there, one cav there. That's nice. The fewer cav, the better for me. Uh, all right, they've got just a single archer here, archer militia. I'm not too worried about them. Two archers here, archer militia, and then one archer militia here and a crossbowman. Okay, I got gotcha. you. So I'm gonna pop all my calf together, probably. Just six calf roaming around, destroying everything, and hoping that my infantry holds up long enough, essentially. There's uh, one calf here, one calf there. Oh wait, no, they've got three calf. They got one calf in every place. Okay. Uh, crossbowmen here. Yeah, they don't have any, any spear guards here, which is a, the scary unit that they've got for my calf. So I think we are gonna start on this side with all six of our calf. Basically, just run them outside. And just kill that entire contingent off. Um, let's bring all of my melee infantry back for a second. Because we do need to hold them in like these areas so that our towers can do a lot of damage. Unfortunately, we of course don't have any formations available, so we are going to just take a ton of damage from those crossbows. So perhaps I'll put them back for a minute. Uh, so we have a total of eight units, okay. I'm only gonna put two here. So we'll put you here and a Saber Militia behind it. And then make them run up as far as possible. Those crossbows might actually already be in range, I'm not sure. Um, then we're gonna hold this one with more units. So we'll take all this stuff over here for a second so I know what we've got. So we got one more of you. We got four of you, and one of you, okay, so let's take three of these over here, and then we're gonna have this hold this place here. These three units. Um, and then we have these three units holding this. Saber Militia at the back, because they're obviously the least armored, but there's only one archer unit here too, so... And then really, it, it all comes down to these units holding as long as possible for my calf to just start doing a ton of damage. We just gotta run through their units as fast as humanly possible. I probably should have put one more unit there, to be honest. Because if, if this breaks, we need to kill all of the. We need to basically kill this entire formation off, except for maybe the general or something. Um, before we move on to the next one. Uh, tiredness, the fact that it's snowing isn't helping either, actually. It's making them slower too, but I think having my cab be slower is a more important thing. Please, feel free to stand there for as long as possible. Use all your arrows at my slightly armored troops, that's okay with me. I'll gladly take that while you all get slaughtered by my archer towers. 
Why is there like a red thing around there? Taking fire? There's no like actual arrow animation though. These guys are taking the arrow animation. Ooh, there's more stuff going this way. Okay. Doesn't change much. Hey, the more you send your cav away, the better for me, right? I'm okay with that. I would prefer if they are... Oh yeah, we need to actually start send you guys off now. Ugh, shoot them this sooner. I'm, I'm a bit too late now, I think. That might be problematic. Because those towers, if they don't do their damage anymore, that's gonna suck. Okay, so yeah, we don't want to charge in there. So we kind of needed to wait longer for them to actually get into melee, because now they're just holding this line. There's not much I can do about it, right? I gotta get in here quickly. Like, if I can get a charge off on a unit that's not stationary, though. Ooh, you're turning back for me, too. No, I'll take that. Like they're not stationary, so they're getting fucking wrecked. Sentinel there. Actually, just go this way. You guys go into that calf. You guys get out of there. One more unit go over here. Charging them. What the fuck was that? Did he just stop moving? Stop talking. Did you? They weren't stationary. Big mistake. Uh, let's have one of you guys chase that unit off. Make sure it doesn't come back. The other one come over here. All right. See, this is the kind of shit we need to charge into. This this calf is not really great. Cause it's holding me back too long. Which is why I didn't want to go to places where they had calf. But you know. What are you gonna do? Is that the unit that's... No, it's not. Okay, charging here. I was gonna say, but is that that unit too? Yeah, we don't want to be dealing with him, but I also can't really do much about it, I'm afraid. I'm already killing them off very quickly. Okay, how are the other shit going? Okay, they're all waiting, getting... Oh, fuck, there's an whole opening over here I didn't think about, but luckily, <laughs> they're not going that way. They're getting fucking destroyed by arrow towers. This is going well. Uh... Okay, made them route too. Get in there. Sword units, I'm gonna bring one of you guys back this way somewhere. You could have probably wrecked this unit fairly enough now, yeah. You're only just getting the kills now. I'm not sure why that took so long, but hey, good enough of me. They've used all their ammo, and this unit is almost dead. Okay, fair enough. Next one. Uh, and you also go that way and kill that unit. We need to win this one on army losses, yeah. See, that's not good. We, we're, not gonna, we're not gonna be able to kill this guy, but now he's gonna get shot by towers. Which hopefully will do enough damage. Okay, routed that unit too. Perfect. Okay, we're just gonna ignore all this stuff over here now and get the fuck out of here. Go kill these archers off. These guys are all getting shot. I think they're gathering up over here. I'm gonna run one unit this way. I'll take you that way. And then that one too. Okay. So you just kind of hope this unit gets shot by arrow tower so much that he routes or something. It's unlikely that's going to happen, but hey, what are you going to do? I can't send any more cav at them because that's my most valuable resource. Okay, and they are out of ammo, so they're not actually running away. Well, they're not. Actually, they are as well. I guess that's these arrow sounds I hear. I'm not sure. But yeah, army losses is what we're going to hope to win this one on. Right. The enemy run Craven. Craven, okay, good. He could break through here, but... There's just not way we not much we can do about that, unfortunately. Okay, they're gone entirely. And any unit that does come back is gonna get shot by tower some more again, so. Alright. That unit will eventually lose probably, but if it holds up long enough. Might be okay. Okay, they're gathering up over here now. You're gonna have to stand there. They're getting shot by towers constantly during all this. This is great. Never seen the AI be disincompetent. And I've still got all of my calf minus one unit, and of course some are wounded, but and this is one of the better units at least against Liu Yao. I wonder if I should walk out and hope he gets shot by Taras more, but it'll probably just kill my own men more than anything. Uh, I can bring you guys back as well, there's nothing left on that side. And I'm also gonna bring this smaller unit this way. Alright. Let's uh, get you guys over this. Okay, they're going for the attack. Let's run. I was gonna walk, but we gotta do the shit now. And they are gonna be full on attacking. I'm just gonna bring another unit over here because it doesn't look like they're gonna wait over there or attack me over here. I mean, I don't know if we're losing that one. I think we are. We are losing men hell faster than he is, but 
men faster than he is health. There you go. We have done so much damage of arrow towers, it's ridiculous. You guys are gonna get shot to pieces now, but we're almost in melee, so that's okay. We got loads of reinforcements coming in too. So we should be able to hold this pretty long for my uh, calf to get there. Just attack order now. And I don't even think I need you here anymore, so let's bring you this way too. Alright. Just gotta hope they all plonk, like, just throw themselves in here, basically. To rid us of their stupidity. Sorry. Um, yeah, throw themselves in there so I can charge them. Because right now, these guys, I don't really want to charge. That said, they're getting wrecked by these arrow towers still, so if they want to stand there, that's okay with me too. Did that unit get shot by arrow towers, or just getting wrecked in melee? This one. Maybe a little bit of both. Still got half HP remaining. Yeah, we're definitely dying faster than he is, but... We're probably gonna make him route by just having army losses here at some point become a problem for them. Still a cab, you know, that's full health. The other one luckily almost died already. In fact, I think it's... I don't see it anymore, so I probably... Oh no, there it is. 14 guys remaining. My cav and units in general are very tired, which is unfortunate. Nice, the route. So far this doesn't look like I gotta ever lose it, but these cav are still scary. A little bit worried about that. So is the champion and of course the uh, this guy over here, who... The only way I'm gonna be able to kill him is if he routes... If he, uh, yeah, so if he sort of routes. Let's just get you in there. Okay, let's send someone into that cav unit. They're kind of blocking me from being able to charge fully in the back of all this stuff, but even a sideways charge with exhausted units should work out pretty well. When they're facing me completely wrong way. Having said that, I probably shouldn't have charged in all three of my units, but eh. More units running. That was a cav unit actually that ran, not the archers, who are surprisingly just kind of shooting at me no matter what. Okay, they charged into my calf with their calf. Now I'm kind of trapped. Was that their plan all along? Or was it my plan to charge my calf into their calf and charge into my calf? Haha! <laughs> I probably should just charge into the infantry, to be honest. Alright, 4v1 this unit. That should be okay. Uh, how's this going? Let's get you in there as well. He's dying. Actually, I might be able to just kill him. Uh, you know what? Let's go for the long con and flank this unit around. You are having a hard time killing these archers, unfortunately. You're having a hard time doing that. Let's get a couple units out here. Just charge, counter charge in there constantly. You're not counter charge, they call out. Just, um. Oh, hello. She's through somehow. You're gonna try and take my town from behind me. That'd be kind of inconvenient. Let's get you in there. How did you run for all these units anyway? It's impressive. Impressive. Okay, my units aren't doing too well, but... I think we got it. A couple charges from these guys will do so much damage that I think we're just gonna... Oh my god, we killed that guy over there and this guy just went back to full HP and so did she. Damn it! All this damned... Um... Oath Sworniness going on over here. I think I'm gonna route all these units though. But if we route all the units, then the generals will follow soon enough. Maybe keep him in melee would have been... Yeah, no, that's... Yeah, send him in. There, uh, he's about to route. She is definitely going to route soon as well. On account of her being some kind of push. Alright, nice. And she's gone too. Sweet. There we go, boys. That is how we do, as they say. I uh, lost the cab. That was actually fighting this unit over here. That's this one here, I imagine. No, it's not. Well, then... Who let that archer unit go? <laughs> Unless you guys just routed that way for some reason. I don't know. Alright, I will definitely want to kill off as much as humanly possible here. So let's make sure we are doing that. I don't think I can reach her anymore. But I will darn well try. I should definitely have killed him off too. I think that was actually that unit chasing him. And then they stopped chasing because they got scaleweed. Um... 
Okay, I've only got these three cab units, so I guess she's getting away. It's okay. Like, this army won't be able to do anything anymore now. I won't be able to go chase it off and kill it, because I don't have an actual army here. This is just a garrison, but that's alright. We killed off most of the troops, too. Ooh, actually. Ooh. Ha! <laughs> hey! Hey! <laughs> I guess he got away, though. Yeah, I was thinking, like, wait a second. She ran for the tower. She's going to have to take some kind of damage over there. Oh, that was good shit. I need to kill her as well. So it's just the champion I got away. 245 kills on that fucking sentinel, though. Not bad. Our cav did uh, as well as we'd expected them to do. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, she's... Oh, she's must be legendary. Nice. That's it every two. You are a faction that I don't want to pick peace out with, so I am very gladly just gonna do this. Execute this woman, Chaiyang. Um, I don't think I need the punishment, I'm taking the money. Oh my god, the other army ran away as well. Wait, hold on, I thought they were in the town. Oh, they, I guess they can still sail away. Okay, well we can take the town no problem now, right? Uh, okay, that's not relevant to me. In fact, that's fine, because this, this guy being at war with more people is good for me. Because they're right, you know, they've got towns bordering me all over the place, I don't want to go to war with them. Faction succession, Yu Ming Shang. Oh, I've seen that happen in many campaigns now. And Liu Yao is dead, Liu Shang taken over. But this guy right here? It sure is. Right, you want to attack my lumberyard again? Wait, that's. My toolmaker again, I mean, sorry. <laughs> That's so full of punish already. Alright, well, yeah, this should be easy now. This army, I don't think, is going to be able to run very far. Except I can't attack it for some reason. Oh. No, yeah, I'm a normal stance. What? Inside an enemy zone of control, but I'm besieging the town, so that shouldn't be possible. What in tarnation is going on here? Well, the army's fucked up, so it might just be not resolved anyway. Oh, I guess we need to do some stuff first, right. Um, yeah, I'll destroy the walls. Create a breach through which we can attack your... You told your general to make it so. And then that should hopefully just be an auto resolve anyway. Yeah, that's... Medium losses is kind of rough. I kind of prefer if I could kill those guys off first, but I can't. I could also wait and see... Nah, that's no, that's no point. I could do the battle. It's just this there, and we there is a gap in the wall at least, and we could blow up more shit with our trebuchets. It's gonna be, it'll be still be painful, but I think that might be okay. Rebellion imminent, right? So we're gonna do this switcheroonie again. Um, so this place is being exempted again, and then this place is being unexempted, and this one's actually gonna be fine from now on too. All right, perfect. Killed Liu Yao. We gained a couple of sweet items that I can trade away if I need to. Uh, yep, especially that one. Okay, okay. Kung Sun Du still not dead. Very impressive, I must, it must be said. Uh, and then this army here. Without a doubt, without for spending any other money. I'm gonna recruit some dudes in here. Crossbows, yep, perfect. And two traps, please. All right, are you any better as a general? You are not. This guy's got all the movement speed and replenishment, etc. Which I do like. All right, and it looks like Gong Dong Zhou might be trapped over there. <laughs> He's trapped. He's actually trapped. He can't get across the river, I guess. All right, I might actually be strong enough that I would be okay with attacking him right now. I could also wait a little bit longer, but I think we're good. What have you leveled up, by the way? Because you don't have any good ability. Yeah, okay, we've got range block chance next level up at least. Uh, okay, that's still pretty far away, but okay. You got decent calf stuff. Range block chance too. Yeah, you're alright. You're alright. And then this army, I don't know what the fuck this army is going to do now, because it, it ran over here to try and help out against Liu Bei. Sorry, Liu Bu. I'll keep missing up. He is in range, but he's in Force March stance. I'm not sure if he'd be in range without that. Garrison here is pretty large. 
but no calf. So recruiting a calf commander here would be great, except for the fact that I don't have anyone available that I can recruit. Because I didn't think about that. I have to recruit someone outside, like Chuan Yi. Or Wu Dai. Or maybe he's just going home. No, he's not. He's definitely going to march for trade ports. <laughs> Let's be honest. Alright. Um, peace it out. Hug it out. I'm surprised that Liu Shang still doesn't want peace, by the way. Got his capital under siege. His only town actually under siege. I just murdered one of his armies. And then somehow he's still like, I think we got a chance. <laughs> Alright, if you think so. Can I pull this? Pull you into this war yet? No. What about the Dongzhou one? Although if I do that, sounds great. Except that would make it impossible for me to get a piece with Dongzhou because I'd have to do an alliance piece, and he might not be up for that at all. So this is definitely doable. I could definitely make this happen. Not that way though. Fuck that noise. I could make that happen though. Um, but. I don't know if that's useful. You know what? Actually, what's our what's our situation like with peace? That's still pretty tough, but I feel like if I kill the Dong, I might be able to sue for peace with uh, Lu Bu. That, like, a non a not like impossible peace, but probably not. It's probably still too difficult to do. So I'm going to have to recruit some shit in there, but oh well. Recruit some guys from outside the faction, that's okay. Uh, Zhang Yan. Let's get you doing something before you dive all day, shall we? Should have been marching. My bad. Wait, stay inside our own territory, so we got the movement boost next turn. All right. Uh, we got any assignments available? We got Gongs and Du available again. All right, let's yeah, shove them in here. Why not? Actually, no. I might want to recruit him there for free. That would be useful. Okay, so Li Bei. The, the problem with Li Bei right now is that he does actually have a couple of armies running running around, and I don't know what to do about that, because he probably is a war with, like, Dong Zhou or something. He's a war with a lot of people. Gong Xinzhan, Duchy of Song, Dong Zhou, yeah. He's probably not gonna attack me with those armies, but I still have to keep an army nearby to kill to attack them if something does happen. So I think you're still going towards Dong Zhou for now. Uh, I will actually... Go to normal stance for a sec. Switch these boys over. Waste some more money, but it's all right. And then I'll uh, I'll, I'll walk for one turn. Actually, these all need some replenishment as well. Okay. If we were fully replenished, I would actually consider attacking him right now, but nah, probably not. Alright, I think we are going to do this. Just to, okay, We lose the mustering bonus, unfortunately, but it also stops him. Well, no, I don't think I can get peace with him regardless, so let's just assume that we're not going to... Well, no. Yeah, let's, let's assume. Let's atta we'll attack him next turn. He's been standing there for two turns, so he's clearly not going to do anything yet. Um, I think this was going to be the shitty... this one. Satisfaction... bunch of shit that I don't give a fuck about, but I needed to get these, this unit. Although, again, pretty fucking irrelevant at this point. Getting the yellow dragons. Available assignments and can do shit for me. That probably be okay, but I'm really not that worried about it. Why can't I get that? Oh right, because I need that one too. Yeah, of course. Is there anything that actually does something for me? Twenty-five percent trade influence actually would probably increase my income by quite a bit. Building upkeep, building upkeep. That's probably decently at this. What was it? Twenty-five percent. One point five k. That'd be three hundred and seventy-five. Could be worse. Um, yeah, it's not bad. Or alternatively, get the trade influence, which would probably increase our income by quite a bit as well. 25% though. We were already on 370. Like, how much is that really going to be? Is that more than a free, 375? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I'm going to go for that one. So, currently, how much are we making right now? 5592. So let's go for that one. So I guess we're giving up on the yellow dragons for now. Just doesn't do enough for me. 5592. Okay, that was less for sure. Yeah. Oh. Well. You live and you learn. Um, we have any diplomacy to do? I don't think we do. 
How much would this take? I think I checked this last time, it was horrible, yeah. I wouldn't do it anyway, because again, I'm going to attack him soon, but... Still interesting to know. Just fucking uh, confused about why I can't attack him. Oh, I can now. Yeah, I was going to say, why why wouldn't I be able to? Oh, and it's an ambush too. Alright, this should probably even be an auto resolve. Yeah, I don't think I should even fight that one. Let's just delegate it. And then I think I will just auto resolve the battle. It'll probably still be medium losses, also he survived. Kind of awkward. I'll take that replenishment. I can definitely reach him again though. We'll do this battle first. Yeah, still medium losses. It's kind of rough. I don't really want to take those because I know I can do better. Um, we have four trebuchets. I mean, four. It's a lot of trebuchets. It's only we notice one piece of the wall that's busted. I still have to run in there. I, I like. I know there's not going to be too many towers that are destroyed yet. You know, that's the main thing. I feel like we're not really going to have any trouble replenishing for a bit. So why don't we just yeah, let's fucking delegate it. Normally I would have probably actually gone for it, but now that I I feel like I don't really need to. I don't have any battles waiting for me, you know, so I can just do it. These armies just gonna replenish for a while. Holy fuck! All right, you can finish them off too. Another ambush. And I really shouldn't lose much there now. All right. Um. Wow. Why were you even in that? You're horrible, mate. Like, just fucking rank. Um, you get to live. You get to make that faction weak. Oh my god, even more. Jesus Christ. Wait, didn't I let him live? How did I... What? Um, okay. So you're out of towns now, right? You want to peace out? No? Uh, so it actually wouldn't even be that difficult to do. But there's nothing he can take. There's no towns anywhere that I think he might be able to take. Except for maybe all the way over here, but I feel like he would have already taken attrition by the time he gets here. Yeah, I think we'll be alright. Let's go through all this shit. We got another horse. Nice. A horse is a horse, of course, of course. I don't have any other... Oh no, I do have a new champion. Yes, there you go. Also, I definitely have a weapon for you. I don't. I don't have a weapon for you at all. I have a loose formation. I should give him that one instead. Um, I have two of those cunning things. Right, have I equipped... Zoom me out. I think I... Didn't I just recruit you? I, did I already give you shit, or did you already have stuff? You're the guy in here, right? Uh, here. No, that's Wang Shang. Never mind, sorry. Still gotta give you shit. You don't have anything. Okay, you're not taking that. You're taking a book. And you'll like it. And yeah, nothing else I have for you, I'm afraid. That's okay. Alright. Let's see. Relationship lost. Battle. We fought... Oh, we utterly devastated the enemy's forces. We lost that one, I guess, because we lost a lot of men in that battle. In that auto off, Which oh, wasn't even that bad, though. We become friends. 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 Lost the battle one again. Friends. Lost the battle one. Friends. Lost the battle one. Friends. Oathsworn. Lost the battle one. Between them? What the fuck? Okay. Oathsworn rivals with uh, that guy. Okay. Because I killed your guy in fam in battle. It's not really my fault, though, is it? And, and the other two... Oh, I didn't even check that one, but that would have been the other general in that force. Okay. That's a lot of numbers here. Holy shit. Ling Ling. Are you going to be fucking happy yet? Come on, man. Free turn still full faction support. It's not even that. Though. It's the population that's the problem. The faction support isn't, gonna, isn't even going to help enough. Uh, yeah, I feel like I need to upgrade this for happiness, but I can't. I don't have the money for that. Shiz. Um, okay, let's just start from the from the top. Right, I was... Con wait, yeah, I was considering asking him to join my war against her, right? Because you can have an army defending my capital, but if you're not at war with her, then you'll never join me. So I need you to join this war against Sheng Zhang. 29, fuck me, son. Why are you going to be so difficult about this shit? You can have that. And you can have this one. 
And then I don't have much left, but you can have this one because it's pretty rank. And I guess you can have that. Do I have nothing else I can give you? This piece of armor, that's okay. 11.7. Can't give you any food. Money can only be 15 total. Oh, sorry, let me ask you for that money. Leak. Wow, my six grand is only 2.7. Okay, so I'm, I'm assuming this uh, regular payment isn't going to be that great either. Okay, that's 15. Let's see. 3.6 grand per turn is 11.7. I'm sorry, maybe that's not going to happen. I can give you a piece of land for it, but I'm not... I mean, I am concerned about it, but not... No, 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 we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. You know who's getting recruited in here? Um... That would be Gongs and Du. Unless Gongs and Du's are getting recruited in this place here. Because I need to deal with that as well. This is this one's more important. This one we got an extra... I think we've gone one more turn before you can even reach me. It's a decent army, but... It might even run out of supplies. Although, to be fair, I don't even know where their town is. Even if they even, they even have a town. Um, and since they haven't had a town for so long and... They're running around just roaming free. I'm assuming that this army just has enough supplies to sustain itself forever. Uh, okay, so we're going to have to recruit an army here. I need to figure out who's not a spy, basically. You're currently... Yeah, it's, it's, it's going to have to be someone new, because I don't have anyone available except for Gongs and Du. Although I guess I could just recruit Gongs and Du by himself, recruit a bunch of units in there. But I think I'd rather get an actual general, an extra one. So yeah, let's see. In our court... Who is not a spy, first of all? And then we'll check between those ones. Han Xing, that's probably a spy. Uh, Cao Ying, you're a vassal of my ally, so you're relatively trustworthy. You came from Kong Rong earlier than that, though. Let's see if there's anyone just straight up not a spy. Uh, you, maybe. <laughs> kind of difficult to say. Um... I don't know, like, this guy could be okay. I mean, he's only really going to be recruited for a little bit. Just to help deal with this situation that we've got currently going on. Even a champion wouldn't help that much. Are you reliable? Liu Shang. That's the faction I've almost killed. Um, Recruitment cost increase is kind of shit. Also, reducing a whole bunch of his stats, but... Got a retinue already. Retinue. Alright, I'm gonna recruit you. To uh to be in this place here. It's expensive fucking retinue to recruit like that. Uh, I need cav actually, you know what I yeah, will recruit a couple of cav, even though it's not the right force for it. Okay, yeah, yeah, you don't lose your um, replenishment. And then I'll, uh, I think I might even want more, no, I can't really afford more calf. I want that one, but I can't afford that too. Okay, that's fine. You can't reach yet. I do want someone in here. Like, I'm pretty sure you can't reach yet. Uh, it's impossible to say, because he can reach, but that's in Force March stance, but... My circle makes it so I can't see his movement beyond this, so maybe he could go all the way over here, which means he could reach, but maybe also it just stops right there if he yeah, goes out of forced time. march stance or regular march stance. I don't know, it's hard to say. Uh, but I don't have the money to recruit anyone else, so I think I will just recruit Gong, uh, Gong Sun Du in here. Because this is like, it would be my last chance. I'm also pretty sure he will not be able to reach this yet, so I'd have more time next turn to recruit more anyway. So let's get Gong Sun Du in here. And then maybe get a couple of units just to get something. We have no calf, so we're calving here. Yeah, I guess. Also, going to do my just die of old age. He becomes more and more un or less and less reliable for this particular job. <laughs> All right, so we dealt with this. Uh, you got a little bit of movement left over. Let's start sending you west. Also, I need to replace these three units still. Yeah, let's go west this way. Okay, that's a replenish for a while. I'm assuming these guys are just going to suicide themselves now because they've got no town left and they need to take something. But, what do I know? Um, you're, This was next turn, right? Yes. Next turn we're going to attack that. Alright. Uh, and then next turn we're going to attack here as well. And this should be quite fun. 
Okay. Killing off Dong Zhou, or well, not killing him off, but at least wounding him severely. Didn't reach yet. Uh, you didn't reach yet. Okay. And Dong Zhou appears to have moved further into the forest. I'm not sure if I could still reach him right now. Let's hope so. Alright, yeah, so he's suiciding as expected. See you later. Take the money. And this one is also not a resolve. Kind of awkward. It's a fishing port. Uh, sorry. I have a cav here. Yeah, it's delegated. It's a garrison, so it's just gonna recruit, replenish itself anyway. Oh, nice. The match Jung. And a uh, horse. That's good. Because it's more stuff I can trade away to get peace. What was that? That was apparently some movement I saw, so I wonder where it was exactly. Alright. You uh, requested that to join. Okay, fine, whatever. Uh, and against Tao. Alright, Zhang Lu even. He declared war on Shi Chi. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, he didn't reach yet. Okay. Oh, yes, there we go. So even if he does besiege me now, he's losing attrition. Or he's losing his men. Perfect. That's exactly what we were hoping for. Uh, so is. Ooh, so is this army. Perfect. He's going to be stranded over here. Can we reach either one of these two armies? Yes, we can still reach that one. We can even reach that one, but I don't want to. I'll take out Dong first. Maybe I can still get peace after all with the Dong. I'm glad this army is actually going to be almost full. I might even stand a proper chance. He does have a trebuchet. That's sucks. Uh, Gong Shenzhan requested their master to go to war with Zhang Lu as well. Dong Zhou liberated Zhang Lu. Okay, I guess he actually declared war on... Yeah, I guess he... They requ requested to go to war with Zhang Lu, and then Dong Zhou didn't want to be at war with the Duchy of Song, so he liberated Zhang Lu. Left him for himself. Um, okay, the Han Empire leader is dead. Faction destroyed. Rong, Rong Shang Meng. That was the Han Empire, right? That was the new leader of the Han Empire. I have no idea. Uh, vassalized Zhang Lu. Oh, okay. Interesting. I wonder what order that was all in. He went from one fucking leader to another, or one master to another. Okay. Uh, foreign trespasser. Hello. Sorry, I'm trying to get home. I've trespassed through your lands before, I'm pretty sure, so I can forgive you for that affront. Ambush you discovered. What? Well, him. Except he's in an encampment stance. How would he have, how would he have tried to ambush? That don't make any damn sense. Uh, Zabu is dead, and Zhu Zhi is dead. We got the Stone Horse as well as the Mach Jian. Pretty good. Definitely the Mach Jian, because I don't like it that much. Although it's good damage, it's just risky to take. I need a Vanguard. I don't have many Vanguards left. All my Vanguards are in the main armies, and they already have good shit. Like, you don't need a fucking Stone Horse, do you? You have a Jade Horseman, that's better than a Stone Horse. Who needs a Stone Horseman? You got a Jade Horseman. Right, what about the Vanguards here? You have a you have Cinnabar Redbow. You don't need a Stone Horse, that sucks. Stone Horse is for, for losers. You have a Stone Rooster, which is clearly better than a Stone Horse. It's also part of Experts of the Palace. Wow, so fucking good, man. Um, here you go, you can have that instead. All right, cool. Uh, I can go away, kill them battle Li Shang. Character developments, couple of dudes available. Random guy. I think I've seen him before. And the guy, the lady with the unpronounceable name, Ju Ji Ji. Maybe not that unpronounceable, unless I messed it up, very possible. Okay, don't want any of them. Go away, go away. Trustworthy and creative. Fantastic traits for uh, two um, sentinels. Do I have any? Nope, I have nothing available. Alright. Well, one of them is coming back. Okay. Cool. So. Now what? Do I recruit more stuff in here? I feel like I do need more stuff. Maybe. We'll see what we're at in a minute. In a minute, we gotta level up. On the dong. Wrong dong. 
Uh, tell me where you are. You're not leading this force. You are. It's because, yeah, you have that. Okay, that's why. Because I can get that on him as well, but I don't know if I want to. I mean, it's a good trait if he is the leader, but he's not. He gets plus morale and well, attacking and defending. You get uh, the attrition from military supply shortage reduction, which is not really ever going to be a problem. So I do. I think the morale is better. So I could give him this just so we have the morale plus those same bonuses. Fatigue resistance for Cav is pretty fucking good as well, though. Or War of the Beast, which is also kind of useful. Man, all these things in here are actually quite good. Like, literally, the, these four are all good. This one can fuck a dick, but... Um, honestly, I think, I'm thinking Fatigue Resistance. I'm gonna take that one. Alright, boys, it's time for you to make your way over to some other place. I wonder if I'm gonna keep an army or two around here. Probably just the one, actually. To run through all of these Liu Bei towns. When we do declare war on him, it will make it easier to make him... Oh, several over here as well, actually, but um, yeah, it will make it easier to actually take take him out, make him make him um, abdicate. I guess if I just attack all the stuff here, attack all the stuff here, and then we'll have other armies go on the offensive on on the actual armies of him. But again, he's got two armies kind of running around randomly all over the place as well. So I will take this town. Secured myself a sweet commandery uh, with that lumberyard cap. Nice. And I gained this warrior's reinforced letter. Fantastic. Alright. Do you guys not want peace, by the way? I'm kind of confused about this. I'm, surp I'm surprised by how many. Oh, you do want peace, actually. But I want more towns, and you're unfortunately my best candidate right now to give me more towns, so. Sorry. Uh, okay, let's do the other fun battle before we start spending all of our cash and sending armies. Because I think these three armies are going to end up being the ones going on the offensive against Liu Bei. Like, his actual lands. We just got to keep an army kind of following this one too. As well as this one. But again, they might be on their way to do other fun stuff anyway, so I don't know. Alright, so yeah, that's not a problem anymore, taking attrition, fantastic. Right, let's do this fun battle here. I'm not sure if I'm actually going to do the battle, but maybe. Because it is the Dong, after all, kind of one, two. It's an ambush, too. Should we kill the fat bastard by ourselves? The fat fucking bastard! Got a 37% chance of capturing him. Also, of course, the nice chance of taking the blade of Zhang Yu. Which is pretty sweet. I'll definitely give that one to like Cao Pi or Yuan Shu or even to Sun Chuan because he's in the fight where he took it, so that'd be nice. Um, I mean, this is clearly like a delegate, but it is the Dong. There's actually, uh, there might even be an achievement for this. There is, of course, the if you fight him, well, either you declare yourself emperor, which you know I've done several times already, or I've already unlocked Dong Zhuo, but the in order to unlock Dong Zhuo. Uh, as a playable faction, you either have to declare yourself Emperor in a campaign, which is quite easy, or you defeat him in battle. Now, obviously, I already have him, so I don't need to defeat him in battle anymore, but I feel like there might still be an achievement for doing that. I don't know if there is, but there might be. And if there is, then I'm going to get it. So, that's where we are. Crossbow boys. Oh, I wonder if I just have them focus him down immediately. Just fucking everyone target him, please. Make ourselves a line kind of awkwardly this thing extends so far that if we if they get in here they're gonna start running away immediately everyone get in here oof we have that as well yeah pop him up front use that on him immediately wreck him uh, it's kind of awkward because they're they get in there they're gonna run that way probably or this way I feel like I need to have my units try and stop them like that, but I also need to make sure I defend myself against their cow, because if they flank around, let's get fucked. Right, anyway, uh, let's charge... I don't know if there's even any point charging the cab this time around. I feel like there is, because I would destroy everything right away. But I don't have to, right? In this particular battle, we don't need to use the cab that aggressively. 
Also, yeah, I recruited Sa Mounted Saber Militia. Oh, these, never mind, these are Mounted Saber Militia. I thought they were the higher tier unit, but they're not. Obviously. Uh, let's move all of you guys up a little bit. Okay, I am actually going to do this. Uh, Treps. Just fire at something, please. Uh, no. I'm not taking that. Run away! Okay. Oh shit, that's his special ability, isn't it? Alright, that's enough. I should probably do individual targets, because otherwise they're gonna win- they're gonna kill this stuff too quickly. Oh, fuck. I the artillery pieces, uh, went a bit hard on that. Our comrade what the fuck?! What the f Wait! <laughs> what? <laughs> that guy was shit. I remember he was the one I was gonna fire anyway, but what the fuck? Oh my god! I should never have fought this. <laughs> Our comrade falls. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, Sun Chuan is half dead as well. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, that was not what I had in mind when this battle started. Jeez. <laughs> he's dead. I don't think he's legendary, so he's just actually dead. Holy shit. Don't mess with the Dong, my goodness. They said do not pursue Lu Bu, but I think it should be do not proceed the Dong. Pursue even. Oh my god, I can't even fucking do this. Jeez, boys. He's destroying my units and everything. This man is not messing about. I will lose and be forgotten. Oh, I should have put them in their formation, to be fair. That was my bad. Okay, let's fucking kill him now, please. I need my ability again. Gee, man, that was that was that was ridiculous. I did not see that coming. You know, gotta be honest with you guys, that was crazy. He's almost riding. He's not unbreakable, at least. All right, we got him. This gentleman. Fucking hell! I I don't know. I didn't see that, guys. You guys could go, go back in the video and just have a look. That that must have been just madness. I'm just just died. Also, I'm pretty sure we don't have to kill them all off here. Because I'm gonna kill him off though, because I'm gonna make sure I fucking take him out. Yeah, I don't have to because it, there he's trapped here. He's not gonna be able to run away. Did we take him out? I didn't even say it. He's so fucking beasty. There's no achievement either. God damn it, that was all for nothing. This guy, he's a sentinel too. He's supposed to have fucking melee evasion. I have good items on that man too. I hope he didn't die. Or I hope it, I hope I can keep those items. Oh he's got a wound, okay. He was legendary. Hey, there was an achievement! The Guangdong Coalition. Let's see what that does. Playing as any faction defeat Dong Zhou. Oh my god. Well, it's his own faction, so I can't. But if I could have recruited him, my goodness, I would have done that. Give me the blade of Shang Yu. So make it even more difficult to get a piece of him. But he's friends with Kong Rong. What in tarnation? Lili. Lili. Um. He's also 75 years old now. Let's execute this man. Oh! Ren 又有多少人蠢蠢欲动? Well, it's the first time that I was the one who actually made that achievement, or that, um, not achievement, the uh, cutscene happen. Holy shit. Um, I don't care this much about the traitor. I don't want to piss him off too much. I can't recruit him. I might have done so if I could have, because he's actually quite good. But, uh, yeah, if I release you, maybe he'll come to me next time. What the... Eh, I'll take the money. 
Oh, I did survive, actually. Alright, Lu Bu's the faction leader, which kind of sucks, because I was hoping it was going to be someone else, like Dong Min. And then I would have just married... Well, I would have tried to marry Lu Bu into the family at some point, but... Never mind. So you're the faction leader now, eh? Peace out. Oh, killing his dad didn't help. <laughs> how, how weird. Uh, let's have a look, actually. So... Executed our generals. <laughs> it wasn't your general, it was your faction leader, actually. I hate to uh, <laughs> put uh, pour salt into the wound, but... Right, I unfortunately can't reach. Yeah, he's actually just gone. I, I mean, I was going to replace him anyway. Probably with Huan Zhan, despite her being a low level. But she does like these people here. Fucking hell. Sun Chuan likes everyone. Yeah, I'll replace her. Why can't I do it now? On assignment. Oh, right, yes. Let's pull her out of assignment. Uh, yeah. Alright. Uh, yep, you got wounded. And we got the blade of, uh, your Zhang Yu. So... You haven't got anything, what the fuck? Got nothing to give you. Alright, do you want this thing? It's pretty good. It's a pretty good weapon. You lose your armor. How much armor have you got? 45. Yeah, you have low armor to begin with, because you got more of a rope than anything else. So that's pretty good, actually. Enable scare and plus 40 charge bonus. There you go. His face just changed, even though he didn't become less happy. Alright, cool. Uh, yep. Oh, actually, that, if I really need a big step up to trade with someone, I can just take that. Oh, you got Maim too. Well, now you're even worse. You are brilliant, actually. You're quite good. You just aren't liked by anyone. That's the main problem we've got here. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna make this... Take, take this stuff back from you, I'm afraid, because you're gonna get fired in a minute. Well, I don't think I'm gonna get rid of him altogether, but I'll replace him for now. Can that other woman even recruit these units? Do you need to be a certain level? I don't know. I may, Maybe I will... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Um, what else we got? Oh, I should have put you in the town. Fuck me, I always made the great mistake there. I'm going to recruit one more cab, but I don't really need much, because this army is going to just kill itself by taking attrition constantly. Um, you've got a trebuchet, which makes me a little bit wary. Perhaps I should get my own. That said, if I recruit this guy and get a couple of trebuchets in there, I... There are, there are, there's only going to be one of them, because they're, they're going to be too wounded to actually have more than that. It's uh, kind of awkward. It's also going to be the problem that if he sieges me out... Actually, you know what? If he sieges me out, can I get an army in there uh, running over there in time? Yes, I can get you... I can't see, but... Two turns? Yeah, I can get you there next turn. I lose the replenishment a little bit, but that's okay. So if he sieges me out, we've got an army reinforcing. If he goes for the attack right away. And if we lose, then we lose this guy who I don't give a shit about. He's going to get fired after this anyway. And if we survive, then... Hey, we survive, right? Uh, I think I need some more calf to get those trebuchets out of the way. Can also recruit them. How much range have you got? Quite a bit, but it's mostly repeating crossbow. There's one regular crossbow. Not a lot of range. Oh, so I am actually going to get Vanguard once. Okay. Now, this army is just going to go up here for now. I don't know what the plan is with this one. Follow this army for the moment. Again, at some point we're going to be attacking Liu Bei. But where exactly, I don't know yet. All over the fucking shop from the looks of things right now. So I'm gonna have one of you guys come down here to to start preparing for that too. And then one of you can sit in here for now. Alright. We got eight grand left over, so let's shove it at some buildings, I guess. Uh, that's actually really cheap, fuck it. Fuck cats. 
Nope. Oh shit, we got tea. We can finally get all these buildings. Um, yeah, I guess I wasn't going for the percentage one. I think at this point I don't even really want that building. I just want some other shit. Oh, wait, is this one already? No. Yes. Wait, this one is the wrong one. Did I? Is this mine down, or was this? Did I get this later on? No, this is mine. I must have. I, I built this purposely myself. I mean, the percentage one does look better to me, to be honest. I don't know why I really wanted the T one. I guess only 20% difference and 50 bucks. I think I did the math and then it turned out that it looked like percentage would, or uh, the regular commerce, like 50 commerce is better than 20% because there's not that many commerce income buildings. It probably makes a difference. Like in some places, I'm sure it's better to have the actual income. In some places, it's not. Let's upgrade this town after all. To be fair, there's another one at level 1, which needs to get upgraded to. Oh, I can. Sweet. Alright. I guess we got some battles waiting for us now. So let's get those started, I suppose. Uh, no other diplomacy, I don't think. On oh, no, a bar piece. Don't want it. What if there's a confederation just like a yes there randomly? Like, how do you even get a confederation? It just doesn't seem possible. At least not on this difficulty. Maybe on higher difficulties, I don't know. Alright, you're besieging me. And he may have... I'm not sure if he moved to besiege me. If he is, then, hey, I'm taking attrition, but I got my army coming in. And if he doesn't, then I don't know what he's doing. Oh, hello. Shit, was that what I was afraid of he was going to do? Oh my goodness, I'm bankrupt. What the fuck happened? That was quick. Uh, okay, that's actually not... That wasn't mine, was it? I don't think it was. Alright, why am I bankrupt exactly? Bunch of wars. Settlement lost. Oh no, it was. He just There was no garrison and there was no people in there whatsoever. So he just walked in and took it. Alright, fair enough. Bankrupt. Okay. Why? Why? Oh my god, this place is almost rebelling. Why is this place almost rebelling? Holy shit, I didn't realize this was so unhappy. I can't do this. It's taking attrition. Oh shit, does that mean every place is taking attrition right now? Oh no. Oh my god, every army is taking attrition. Oh fuck me. They already took attrition, in fact. Oh my god. Why did I go from like six grand income to. Oh jeez. Because my capital's under siege, that's why. Fuck. Okay, tell me I can deal with this. Can't. I can though. These units will mess this up, right? I think so. All right. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to try that next time because I can't deal with this massive amount of uh, money loss. I'm everyone's taking attrition. This is not helpful at all. Um. Okay. Like if this fucks up my campaign out of nowhere. I'd be pretty upset. All that attrition is fucking painful. All right, and we got a noble's armor, a noble's letter. All right, cool. Well, we'll have to do with that next time immediately. Until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day, and goodbye.